Today we're gonna be testing which yacht best survives the tsunami and storm works, and at the end, I'm gonna choose which one I would rather be in. Let's get started. So over here we have the smaller sized yacht, and then the medium sized luxury yacht right here. And then just to the right of it is the super yacht. Oh my gosh, and that's not all. We have the mega yacht. Okay, this is like the billionaire's paradise thing right here. But all right, the first boat we're gonna be using is this small little dinky thing right here. All right, so we're gonna get in here, start this thing up somehow. I think you just click that key button right there, full throttle, and we're gonna spawn in this tsunami. All right, so we are up and running. Let's go in our actual custom menu right here and spawn the tsunami so all right tsunami is currently being spawned in where is it coming from oh this is scary this is always the worst part because you don't know where it's actually coming from but we're on full speed wait what's that in front of us do you guys see that oh look at those i think those are mountains wait no those are uh moving mountains so that means they're waves okay we're gonna be going full speed straight towards it in this small little yacht right here let's see if we can actually um drive over it or if we're gonna sink instantly i mean that's probably what's gonna happen if i'm gonna be honest but let's see here we go look at that super large wait oh i see it cresting oh no i have a lot of trust in this thing not really okay here we go we're going straight towards it let's see if we can survive so we're gonna start rising here right now we're starting to rise no can we rise it not go under it um wait what are we going complete oh our engine just stalled hold on what's going on we're really starting to angle here oh this is really sketchy i don't know about this yacht guys this is uh very interesting okay, well i guess we didn't like completely die right there we're um i think we're fine yeah but like that was pretty rough next up is the medium sized luxury yacht oh yeah all right so we're inside how do we actually start this thing so up here we click maybe port side engines there we go starters and put that down and full throttle here we go full throttle completely gun it and oh there we go this thing actually is pretty quick all right it's official we're gonna be spawning in a tsunami right now let's probably not turn towards those rocks over there all right so where's the tsunami wait a second it's not even spawning over there that's where it spawned at last time okay so where's it spawning at we're gonna do a u-turn here see what's going on i'm not seeing anything over there um over here anywhere oh i think that you guys see all that waves over there i think those might be waves okay we're gonna head straight over there there that might be what i think it is let's go grab our binoculars here um oh yeah those definitely look like they're moving okay we're gonna have some issues here in a second but we're gonna see if this medium yacht can survive um our engines just exploded okay so that's a little bit scary i don't know about this one guys but the tsunami's still coming in hot i don't think we have enough time to do a u-turn here and like kind of restart this do we have fire suppression um i don't think so oh that's great okay well fiery medium-sized luxury yacht versus tsunami i can see the fire actually rising out of the deck right now this is a little bit concerning um hopefully the water puts out the fire i mean that might be the upside to this if there is an upside here we go we're starting to rise okay let's see if we can actually stay above the water it's looking pretty good um oh there we go okay it's actually not doing that bad at all i'm not even going underwater over here okay that's great and oh so much air time look at all the fire and smoke and here we go we're gonna crash down wow okay well we did survive that i don't know if we have like a water leak going on back there um that's weird I'm actually really curious what's going on down there so we're gonna go down here oh my kitchen's on fire oh no oh wait player damage is on oh i forgot God. oh no we died now we have the super yacht fitted with two jet skis and two speedboats in the inside now let's figure out how to get this thing started so we're gonna teleport up here in the bridge Ooh, it is super dark in here so you're telling me we only have like six buttons in here for a yacht this size that's kind of concerning all right so let's go ahead and start this so bridge systems deck lights nav lights everything on engine main switch um all right full throttle and is that all we have to do um oh we got some cool lights going on out here engines do not seem like they're starting they look like they're at a complete stop but we're still on full speed um maybe bow mass no um i don't oh yeah drive mode here we go drive mode is on let's see oh there we go we're getting some spin all right they're spinning but we're not really going anywhere i guess we're moving a little bit um there we go now they're starting to kick up a little bit perfect i'm honestly impressed we got this thing started but let's see what's going on in here so we got the bow spotlight those are pretty bright lights right there near the anchors all right so i think we're clear to spawn in this tsunami um this thing is pretty leggy um look when i jump in the air it's like in slow motion i have early access to the space dlc just from um spawning this so let's go ahead and spawn in the tsunami right now so spawn tsunami all right where's it coming from but yeah this yacht is completely fitted with interior i don't know why i just got a warning but right here we actually have the grand staircase and right here is the cool um i don't know just dining area thing with some lights i'm looking for the tsunami out here and i'm not seeing anything oh never mind i definitely see a little bulge coming out of the ground over there okay so i think that might be a small wave going towards us that's fine let's go in the um actual driver's seat over here and turn towards it all right we're going full port side right now let's see how good this thing steering is we're going full left rudder or yeah that's how you say it so we are full left and this is going to take 10 years yeah i don't think we're going to be facing directly at it by the time the tsunami actually hits this thing has very slow steering which is probably realistic for this type of boat but you know i'm just saying it is pretty slow i'm also activating bow thrusters right now i think that's what it's called actually it's stern thrusters straight right i don't know something like, that might be like in a different language i have no idea okay just let me know in the comments if you know what strafe means i don't know if we're gonna make it in time the tsunami is right there we're still going full left this 
this is going to be very close. Um, Uh-oh, it's starting to kind of crest right there. Keep going. Turn, turn, turn. Okay, we're going to go to our engine monitor here. Make sure everything's looking good for it. I think it is. Here we go. If we hit the tsunami going sideways like this, we are definitely going to flip over and capsize. Uh, That's not good. Oh, gosh. Here we go. I see the water starting to rise right there. And now we are starting to rise the tsunami. We got this thing hammered. And hopefully these engines are powerful enough. They're barely powerful enough to even power the yacht. But let's see. Oh, we are actually really starting to dip underwater here. Here. This is not looking good. Oh, we're starting to roll. Oh, no. Uh-oh, that's really bad. Um, okay. So, oh, it's not even watertight up here. Okay, well, that's definitely a issue we're having. And now we're about to get a whole bunch of airtime. Let's see if we can actually um, land up right here. This is definitely going to be the hard part. Oh, yeah, this is what I thought would happen. Completely on the side like that or upside down. Oh, no. All right, let's see. Will it flip back over? Is it that? Oh, wait. Actually, it's looking pretty good. Here we go. Oh, that's really sketchy. I don't know. If we're gonna make it here we go guys i think it officially flipped back over wow okay that's pretty impressive so this thing has a low center of mass um noted now we have the 108 meter billionaires mega yacht oh this thing is massive probably gonna take so long to start let's probably get started on this so up here's where we drive this thing at this thing is packed with interior oh okay so we have some like fake displays up there i can't even see the windows how am i supposed to see okay so i think this actually has less buttons than the um other yacht that we were using a bit ago so that's a little bit concerning and then w and s is our throttle and it works instantly wow okay so we are already running i didn't even have to click anything to start that's amazing look at all these floors completely decked to the brim oh my gosh whoever made this actually does interior in real life they just have to there's no way oh there's pictures of the yachts inside oh that's so cool and this thing has steering on a dime look at this oh my gosh let's go ahead and actually spawn in the tsunami so spawn tsunami there we go it's coming in from somewhere but before we actually completely crash this thing and ruin it let's see what's going on in the interior here so right here is this cool little dining area a whole bunch of pictures of the yacht very nice detailed bed right here i've never seen anything like this and then if we open this door right here we have the most luxury bathrooms i think i've ever seen in stormworks so look at this bathtub that is amazing with the sink amazing view with the walk-in shower this is just one of the best yachts i've seen probably the best actually but it is pretty laggy of course so you're gonna need a pretty good computer to actually run this and right here we have like a wait is this an elevator oh my gosh that looks like it goes really far down hold on we should kind to do this call elevator here we go what is going on here where's the elevator at oh there it is it's rising a glass elevator in a ship that's a little bit scary okay so where's this actual tsunami coming from where is it at oh it's right over there we can turn on a dime so we'll just continue doing this for a little bit here it is the elevator is arriving let's see we're gonna go straight to the lower deck okay we're going to floor one here we go imagine there's this water piling in there and we just keep going down oh that would suck oh look at that all right we're at the bottom what is going on down here oh this is just so nice dude who made this interior they need raise okay so tsunami's over there we need to start turning probably about now so where do we drive this thing somewhere up here perfect get in the sea here go full port side right now oh look at all them engines actually running perfect and we're just gonna slowly turn over there and let me know in the comments if you think this thing will survive so we have this thing on full speed currently it's on one all right amazing uh the tsunami is taller than the yacht itself so oh yeah and i just looked inside of the yacht and there's like four jet skis wait i think six what about the other side um no that's a weight run but here we go the tsunami is right there we are starting to rise the tsunami in the mega yacht. Let's see if this thing can actually survive. The bow is really starting to dip under here. Oh my gosh. What is this thing doing? I don't think we're supposed to be doing this. Um, wait, why is it like perfectly still? Wait, what the heck? Why are we going so far underwater? This does not look ideal like at all. What's in the world? We're just completely like floating still. This isn't even affecting us at all. Okay, now we're completely in the air, still somehow upright. This is pretty impressive if I do have to say that. And we're gonna crash down, not even affected at all that is insane what kind of stability does this thing have wait a second we have damage on board oh wait what's going on up here something's breaking all right it's the moment of truth which yacht will i choose that best survives the tsunami so the first little baby yacht um actually capsized the second we went over it i think it did correct itself though but i don't really like that one the next yacht's engines actually ended up blowing up which is insane um definitely not that and then the next one was the super yacht that that one actually ended up completely capsizing it did end up flipping back back over but that just didn't do it which means the mega yacht is actually the best survivor for the tsunami yeah guys that's probably gonna be it for the stormworks testing video let me know if i should do some more of these make sure you guys like and subscribe hit that bell join the discord link is in the description but thanks for watching and goodbye